Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Motivation for Young Christians. Welcome back, welcome back. Welcome back to another episode of Bible Study. This is Bible Study episode 65. Today we're going to be diving into Isaiah chapter 26, verses 4. To begin, we're going to start off with a prayer by me. If you guys can, please bow your heads, close your eyes. Heavenly Father, we thank you, praise you, we worship you. We thank you for this day that you have made our joys begin, God. We just thank you for now, God, a time that we're able to dive into your word, God, to be able to discuss your word, God, and express our comprehension of your word, God. We pray that you'll have your word, God. We pray that you'll be with us today, God, that we'll be able to apply your word onto our life, God, and continue to learn more about your word, to continue to gain a closer relationship with you, God. Have your word, God. In Jesus' name, amen. Now we'll be diving into our word for today, Isaiah chapter 26, verse 4, reading from the NLT version says, Trust in the Lord always, for the Lord is the eternal rock. This is a very important scripture because we should always put our trust in the Lord. The Lord wants us to put our trust in him because he is trustworthy. He will always have our back. We'll never have to question his loyalty to us. We'll never have to question um, anything from him because he will continue to be there um, through always. And it, our trust with him is very important for our relationship with him to continue because once you have trust in the Heavenly Father, you will know what he's capable of, know what he's doing. And when a doubt comes into your mind, you always remember that I trust in the Lord and I know what my God is capable of. I know what he will do unto my life. Always to put your trust in the Lord and to the Heavenly Father because he's a trustworthy person. And the second part of scripture for the Lord God is the eternal rock and he is the eternal rock. He is the foundation as we mentioned in um, Acts uh, a couple of Bible studies ago where we talk about God being a cornerstone. He's a cornerstone um, of our lives. He is the foundation and uh, we need to have him as a foundation. And Lord is the eternal rock. He'll continue to hold us up. He continue to keep us up. He continue to be there for us, strengthen us and be the foundation um, to continue to help us be built and lifted up. And we got to continue to lift up the Heavenly Father and put our trust in him. And that's the word set for today, Isaiah chapter 26. Verse 4, trust in the Lord always, for the Lord God is the eternal rock. I'll be going into our closing prayer. Heavenly Father, we praise you. We worship you. We thank you, Father God. We thank you for the day that you've made. I rejoice and began it, God. Pray that we'll always put our trust in you, God, no matter what, God. When trials and tribulation come, when we're having our good moments, our bad moments, when we're scared, all of the above, God, we pray that we'll always put our trust in you and know that my Heavenly Father is Lord is King. My Heavenly Father is capable of a lot, and He is a trustworthy person, God. And we pray that we'll always remember that you're the eternal rock. God, you are the foundation, God. You are the cornerstone, God. And we pray that we stick with you along the way, God. We pray that our foundation will be built up on you, God. So that way we're able to live a life onto you, God. And we'll always put our trust in you, Father God. And we'll always lean on you for help, God. Not lean on our own understanding, but lean on the understanding of the Heavenly Father, God. We pray that you have your way within us, God. We just thank you and we praise you and we bless you, God. In Jesus' name, amen. This is it for the video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Thank you guys. Thank you guys so much. If you haven't already, like the video. Subscribe if you're new. Please turn on your post notification. That way, anytime I upload a video, YouTube will send your notification. This is Motivation for Young Christian. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.